As millions of students return to college campuses this fall, two graduate students of sorts will be taking off on an unusual academic adventure. I'm going to go to the most famous universities in the world, and I get to go all the way around the world. When Andy Valber studied international relations at Cal State, he never got to go anywhere. For two weeks this semester, he gets to go back to school as the ultimate exchange student and internet correspondent. I can't tell you exactly where I'm going because there's prizes involved, but I'm going around the world and I'll be sending back clues and digital images and email and uh, using those clues, you can start looking for me uh, and I'll be out there and I'll be out there every day posting new clues all the time. It's all part of a series of live campus events and ultimate web surfing contest called Escape Back to School. Hosted by Excite, one of the largest search engines and portal sites on the web, it's designed to help students and professionals refine their web researching skills while sharing some real-time adventures in academia. Some people might call these gut courses. I call them my dream curriculum. For Escape 101, Greg Milano's dream assignment is to cross the country taking the most unique courses and extracurricular activities. Well, I was an American Studies major at uh, Georgetown University and uh, I took the usual American history, American politics, and, uh, but I didn't get into the, uh, the funner side of Americana. And that's uh, so what these courses, what I'm going to be doing is uh, really getting into the, the, the fun and the, the, the cool parts about America, stuff you wouldn't believe. I never believed I could take a course on. Like his exchange student colleague, he will be reporting online each day, sending back digital clues for students testing their web searching skills trying to find him. This ultimate web surfing test is pass-fail, but the sponsors of the event are putting up prizes like a free trip around the world, a new car, and a wired dormitory room to keep it competitive. This is Mike Saray reporting.